you know, we know that this gene makes you sick. You know, it's the cause of everything horrible that happens, and people who inherit the abnormal form live long enough to show that something kills you. And that could be, you know, anywhere from 2 to 92. So we said, well, uh, if we could find a way to shut it down, uh, turn it off, that would be a cure. And again, in 2002, we started having workshops. You know, workshops have just been uh, our salvation. That workshop was with Bob Horvitz and Phil Sharp and David Hausman, Richard Mulligan, a whole bunch of, you know, gene gurus at MIT. And we said, let us, if there is actually a way to turn off, turn down Huntington's, that's the cure. Don't, you know, stop every, you know, from being sick. Don't have to recover if we only get sick in the first place. The advantage of Huntington's, it's not a great advantage, but it's just the same gene worldwide. You know, because after we found it in Venezuela, we went to Peru, to Papua New Guinea, Australia. So we sort of persuaded Beth to start working on Huntington's. We were the first people to fund her. And she was using gene silencing, you know, and, uh, you know, first went from, you know, shRNA, microRNA. So, the, you know, you're just getting more and more sophisticated about how do you actually turn the gene off. And the very first um, person to try it, again, was a member of our science board, Frank Bennett of Ionis Pharmaceuticals. And so he, you know, he's using uh, antisense and oligo antisense and sticking it right into people's, you know, silent spinal cord. And I think, um, and people um, have had no bad reaction to have, you know, having this medicine, uh, not toxic in any way. And so now, they're, you know, having a really a phase three, which is glorious. Uh, Roche took it over, which is even beyond glorious. <laughs> and the phase three is probably going to have 100 people worldwide and for a couple of years and uh, at the highest dose. More people who are trying it in different ways. I think, you know, the more the better.